Sorry. Okay, Liz, so we're going to teach you touch math. We're going to teach you touch math so you're not using your hands when you add and you subtract, okay? So we're going to pick dots on these numbers, okay? And we're going to do it with Play-Doh because if we did it with marker and pen, your brain wouldn't remember it, okay? So we're going to do it physical where we can touch it and feel it and see it. All right, so we're going to start with the numbers one through five first. Touch dots are going to be points that we're going to memorize where they're at on these numbers, okay? And I'll show you how we're going to do it. So for the number one, the dot's going to go here, and we're going to touch and say one, okay? Can you do that? All right, you try. So where does it go? Mm -hmm. One. One, good, okay? And then for the two, we're going to put one, and then we're going to do two, just like that. So one, two, okay? All right, now I want you to do it. One, mm -hmm. two. Good. Okay. Can you touch for me now real quick? Can you try? One, mm -hmm. one, two. Good job. Okay. Now for the three, we're going to do it on all the ends. So one, two, two three. Mm -hmm. Yep. So the two got them on the ends, and the three is going to get them on the ends, and the one got it on the ends. So one, two, Three. three. Okay, so I'm going to pull these off and I'm going to let you do it. Go for it. One, mm -hmm. two, three. Good. Okay, now touch them for me and do it one more time. One, two, three. Good. Okay, the four, we're going to do the ends and the corners. Mm -hmm. Okay, so two ends. So one, two, three. So one, two, three, four. four. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, go ahead. One, mm -hmm. two, three, four. Good. Now go back over them with your finger for me. All of them? Just the four. Okay. One, two, three, four. Good. Okay. The next one we're going to do is five. And we're going to do all the ends, we're going to do this end, this end, this end, then we're going to do the belly and the butt. <laughs> okay, so you remember. So end, 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 belly, butt. Okay? All right, so we're going to go one, two, three, four, five. Just like that. Okay? All right, you try it. Okay, now go over it with your finger for me. The five. Go ahead and go. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, good. So after we do the first five, we're going to stop and we're going to take all the points off. Okay, and now I'm going to have you go back through and you're going to teach it to me. Okay. okay? Teaching it to me is going to help you remember 95% of what you learned, okay? So where does that one go? One. Mm -hmm. Nice job. Okay, now I'm going to grab this board real quick. Okay, so we want to do it there. Then we want to take a paper and pencil so your brain can hold on to it. So I'm going to write the numbers on here. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to take this away. And now I want you to put the dots on the number, just like if you were doing it in class with paper and pencil. Mm -hmm. Count them as you do. One through five okay so you've got one through five down that was awesome okay you've got that down all right so now let's do six seven and eight all right let me show you six seven and eight okay 
So for the numbers after five, six, seven, and eight, these numbers are a little different, okay? So here's your six, seven, eight. So for six, this is how we do it. For six, we're gonna do the end, the butt, and the belly, okay? So we're gonna do the end, the butt, where it comes together, and then we're gonna put it on the belly, okay? So that's one, two, three, okay? And then after we do those, we're gonna go back around them. We're gonna do a circle inside a circle. So we're gonna go one, two, three, then we're gonna come back up and we're gonna do a circle over a circle. So it would be like one, two, three, four, five, six. Mm -hmm. So everything after five, you're gonna double. So it looks like this. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, five, six. So the first thing you're gonna do, you're gonna put on those dots first. If you're writing it, you're gonna go one, two, three, then come back around. Four, five, six. Just like that. Okay? Alright, let me do this. Okay, so where do the dots go on the six? Mm-hmm. Good, and then we go back up, mm -hmm. four, four, five, six. Good, okay, now let's do seven. Seven's gonna be the same way, okay? This is how you're gonna remember seven. This is you, and you're standing here waiting to get on our elevator, okay? So here you are, number one. Now, you get on the elevator. Once we get on the elevator, we cannot jump back off the elevator. So we only go from here to here. So there's one, then we're gonna go the first floor, the second floor and the third floor. So that would give us one, two, three, four. We're at the bottom of the elevator. Now we have to ride the elevator back up, okay? So we are at the bottom, the elevator took us down. The only way to go back up is to take the elevator back up. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four. Now we go back up the elevator, five, six, Remember, you can only go up and down the elevator. Do I jump back over here? Can my elevator go sideways? No, this was me getting on the elevator, so I cannot come back over here. My elevator goes up and down, okay? It can only go up and down. So I go right there. Okay, so I go one, two, three, four. Now come back up the elevator, five, six, seven. My elevator cannot go sideways, so I don't go back over there, okay? All right, you teach me. Let's do number eight. For number eight, kind of looks like a snowman, okay? So you're gonna give it two ears and two feet on each side, okay? So we're gonna go one, two, three, four. So two ears, two feet. Now we're gonna go back around each of those, okay? So we go back around. So we're gonna do five, Two ears, two ears, two feet, two feet. Okay? All right. Let me get this to you on your hand. Okay, go for it, cutie. Let's do 
if you actually can't jump sideways off the elevator. Good job, good. And if it will help you to, Olivia, when you get done here, go back up with your circles. So go five, six, seven, and then you won't jump over. Okay, okay, let's do eight. Draw the dots with pen and paper. you're going to want to jump over here. So you're down there, just come straight. So you rode the elevator down, now let's ride it back up. Five, uh -huh. six, seven. Yep, because I can't jump off the elevator to come back over here, so I can only ride it up and down, yeah. not sideways. Okay? All right, let's do your eight. Do you understand that? Mm -hmm. Okay, so now let me show you how to add and subtract using touch math. Okay, I'm going to put some numbers on here. And we never do number nine. Nine is always the biggest number, and we're always going to say the biggest number out loud. So let me show you. We had nine plus four, seven plus two, um, five plus six. Step number one, we always look and we find the biggest number. So what's my biggest number here? Nine. So say that out loud. Nine. So you're going to touch it and say 9. So you're going to go 9. Now we're going to put our dots on the smaller number. So we're going to go 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. 13. Okay? Same things if I were doing it backwards and subtracting. I'm going to change it to a subtraction sign. Touch this one and say it out loud. 9. Now let's count backwards. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. So what's 9 minus 4? 5. How much easier is that? Yeah? Okay, so you do these. Take me through this one. How are we going to do 7 plus 2? 7. Mm -hmm. 8. Mm -hmm. 9. You got it. Yeah, she's scared. She's like, oh, I'm going to get it wrong. You're not going to get it wrong. You're great. Okay, now let's change this to a minus sign. Let's do 7 minus 2. Okay? 7, 6. Beautiful. Okay, now let's do this one. Let's start with six. Yep, always start with your biggest number. Six. Uh huh. Seven. Mm -hmm. Eight. Mm -hmm. Nine. Mm -hmm. Ten. Eleven. Beautiful. Good. Good. Okay. Now let's do some some subtraction ones. Um, what's one that you missed the other day on your homework? Do you remember? Do you remember, Shannon? What was it? Ten mi minus eight. Okay. So ten minus eight. Okay. What's your biggest number? Ten. Okay. Now let's dot our eight or do it. You know how to do it. So we're gonna say ten. Ten. Mm -hmm. Nine. Uh huh. Eight, mm -hmm. seven, mm -hmm. six. Mm -hmm. And then what do you do? Hold on. You only gave them, what do you have to do to the eight? You dotted here, here, and here. What do you have to do now? Six, mm -hmm. five, uh -huh. four, there you go. three, two. two. There you go. What was your answer the other day? Do you remember what it was, Shannon? Three. It was three? three. Okay, because you kept you were off by one because not knowing which one to start with. Gotcha. Okay? So watch this. If you have a big number like this, 132 plus 456. Okay, we always start in the ones house. So let's start there. So we're gonna start here. Let's add it. 
it. Mm -hmm. Seven, eight. Good. Okay, now let's do the tens. Let's do the hundred. Four, five. Good. Okay, now is that much easier than you having to draw it out in tens, hundreds? Mm -hmm. Yes, much easier. Good. Okay, let me give you a subtraction one. Okay. Okay, let's do subtraction. Three. Easier? Mm -hmm. Does that make you happy? Good, I'm glad. Okay, so let's try this one. Let's do eight plus seven. That's good. You're good. Eight, nine, mm -hmm. ten, eleven, twelve. Now come back up your elevator. Thirteen. Mm -hmm. Good. So what's your answer? Good. Okay. Just like that. It's that easy. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. You feel better now? Mm -hmm. Good. Okay. So this is what you're going to do to practice every night. Okay. Mom's going to write these on here. Okay. Mom's going to write numbers on here. And you're going to practice every night just putting your dots where they need to go. Okay. So just put your dots where they need to go. There you go. Sound good? Mm -hmm. All right, you got it. Good job. You learned it all? Good? All right, let's pick our dots up. All right, she's got it. Stop. Yeah, you can stop it. 